AFC matchup on tap between the New Orleans Saints and the Los Angeles Rams. And we are underway from SoFi Stadium. From the end zone, here comes Brandon Powell. And tackled at the 21-yard line, so a net negative there of four yards. They'll fake it. Now Stafford. And the hook up here to Allen Robinson. And they work this well upfield across the 45. A good pick up there, 26 yards. A big hitter to start the drive has him up near midfield here for first and 10. Here's the first carry of the game for Cam Akers. And he's going to take this across the 50 and into Saints territory. Following the pickup of four, here's second and six. They'll toss this right side to Cam Akers. And still about three yards shy of a first as the four-yard pickup brings it to third down. Coming up here looking for three yards to pick up the first. Stafford on third down. And this pass broken up. Excellent coverage there on third down as that was not an easy one to hold on to. That sure looked like a nice call by the defense and they're very cohesive in their coverage. As soon as he cut inside, they broke on the football and met him as the ball got there and forced the incompletion. And he will have first down yardage as he's brought down at the 41. A solid pickup of five and a very solid fourth down conversion and defensively pure frustration. The fourth down run successful. Now they look to pay it off on first down. They'll fake the give. Now Stafford rolling to his right. And that is caught on the right sideline, but out of bounds, says the line judge. The throw took him a little too far. It's second down. Here now is second and 10, again from the 41. Throwing is Stafford. Escaping the pressure right. And that is intercepted on the sideline. Wait, no. They'll say no. It was caught out of bounds. So this is just an incompletion here. Throwing on third down. Stafford. Caught out left side by Robinson. And he will get him down a couple yards shy of the first down marker. A nice tackle coming up from his free safety spot. They'll run for it with Akers. And he's going to get this down near the 20-yard line. A big pickup of 12 yards on fourth down to keep this drive from stalling. So after the conversion on fourth, here's first and 10 just outside of the red zone. Now a play fake it at Stafford. And that is caught on the right sideline, but out of bounds, says the line judge. The throw took him a little too far. It's second down. An incomplete pass on first down. That leads to a second and 10. Stafford going to give this to Akers. And they work this near the five. He'll be stopped at the six. 40 yards rushing for him here. What a start to the ball game. It's first and goal. They'll run here with Akers. And he'll get into the end zone. Touchdown, Rams. Cam Akers, a six-yard touchdown run. And the Rams will jump on top with the game's first score here this afternoon. Extra point by Gay is up and good. And it's now a 7-0 game. Following the touchdown, here's Gay to kick it away. This fielded right at the goal line. The lane opens here. He's past the 30. He's at the 40. 20. And they are not going to catch him. He's in. Touchdown, Saints. Well, there you go. They gave up a score to start the game, and as quick as they could get it back, they did on the return.
And people talk about this all the time, whether you're coaching it, whether you're trying to work on it, whether you're just trying to put in the minds of your players. Attack back as fast as you can after giving up a score. No quicker way than on a kick return. Powell now to take it out of the end zone. And this return will net positive as he gets past the 25 and up to the 27-yard line. Set to begin their next drive, the Rams offense at the line. And that last drive was very, very balanced, pretty methodical. You think they go that route again? I'm always of the school that until they stop me from doing something, I'm going to continue. And I think that that's exactly what they'll look to do. But the beauty is the balance that they've created sets up opportunities for big plays. Looks like a run, turn into a play action, and throw one deep. And he'll push forward for a couple to the 34. Ladies and gentlemen, that is a force of nature at the defensive tackle position. Yes, he's as big as they come, but still plenty agile. He's able to make a nice play there to swallow up the ball carrier. Going up top for Cup. And got his man complete. Touchdown, L.A. Cooper Cup, 66 yards. And the Rams have taken the lead seeing some pretty good offense here in this first quarter. It's been a wild start to this quarter, as you noted. And now, with that lead that we're seeing, can they retaliate? I get the sense this one's going to go back and forth all game long. And that probably won't be the last long touchdown that we see in this one. Extra point by Gay is up and good. And that makes the score 14-7. to Gay now set to kick it off. Taken at the goal line. And his guys will get the football right at the 20-yard line. here with Dalton. He'll buy some time. Now the pressure comes and he goes down. Just inside the 10, back at the 9. Leonard Floyd, the old Georgia Bulldog, finding his way into the backfield. Throwing on second and long. Dalton. There's Chris Olave. Finding space at the 40. And now the rookie's free. Touchdown. Chris Olave, 91 yards. And the Saints are able to strike quickly here as they are in for six. Lots of look to add the extra point. And we've got a good one brewing. We're all knotted up at 14. This one tied at 14 now as he sends this one away. This taken in at the goal line. And he'll go down as this drive will start at the 25-yard line. Set to begin their next drive, the Rams offense at the line. And right now, we've got a little bit of an offensive masterpiece going on both sides, moving the football, scoring points. It's almost like somebody put the defense on rookie mode in this one. I mean, we haven't even left the first half, Charles, and we're certainly on pace for a shootout. An excellent start for both offenses. The fans have to be enjoying this to see all these points go up on the board. As a former defender, you know I'm not enjoying this at all. But right now, both these teams just trading haymakers. Let's see if anyone slips up first. Can anyone counter with a nice little jab and get things going in their direction? The last run good for two. Here's second and eight. Stafford now to throw. And quickly into the hands of Robinson. And this is going to be another first down as the tackle's made at the Saints 23. They give up the middle to Akers. 
And a short gain here down to the 22. Credit him with a one-yard gain there to make it second and nine. Now Stafford. And that is incomplete. Good defensive call right there because they had someone shadowing him along his entire route. And he was right there ready to provide a hit that prevents him from making another catch to his big start. The Rams on third down, just one for three thus far. This is third and nine. Now Stafford. And it's complete. He's got it in the end zone. Touchdown, Rams. Allen Robinson on the receiving yeah, end from Matthew down. Stafford. And the Rams have broken our tie as they take the lead. Extra point by Gain is up and good. And the lead is now 21-14. To the touchdown, it's Gay to kick this one away. And here comes a return from a few steps into the end zone. And he'll be brought down at the 28-yard line, so the decision to bring it out of the end zone gets him three more. The Saints offense on the field, ready to get their drive started. They'll look for a drive to tie this up, down 21-14 as they have it first and 10. Dalton. Oh, into a sea of defenders and intercepted. And the Rams are going to take possession of the football. Well, oh, and I saw the pressure coming out, and that just looked problematic. Hit him as he threw it, and the interception ensued. Let me pay homage to the man who stood in this spot before. He always talked about how much pressure is in the face of a guy, and can he step into a throw. And when you can't do that, oftentimes interceptions result. And he'll be out of bounds after his short pickup, as that's going to take us to the two-minute warning. Coming up on second and seven. Off the fake to Akers, here's Stafford. Trying to find Cup, but it's intercepted. Picked up by Pete Werner. And the Saints are going to get the football here at their own 23. Well, I would guess it combined, if you spoke to both defenses, neither side has a lot to celebrate today. They haven't had a lot of stops, but that one right there, that's a big one because they stole points away with that play. And just as importantly, picked up a key stop on an offense that's been really impressive here in the early going. And that is incomplete. Oh, the coverage a little too good there, and it's second down. Here's Dalton. He's going to loft one deep left side here. Oh, that's into a double team, and it's intercepted. And his guys are going to take over at the 31-yard line. Line of scrimmage, the 31 now on first and 10. After the interception, here's Stafford. That'll be caught. It's Cup. A big play there on the catch and run. 63 yards. A chance to really cap off a big first half here as they come up on first and goal. They'll run a draw now with Akers. And he'll get him a bit closer as he's down to the two-yard line. That gets him three yards closer here as it brings up second and goal. Again, it'll be Akers, and he takes it across for a Rams touchdown. Cam Akers with his second touchdown here in this first half. And the Rams will extend their lead in the final minute of the half. Extra point by Gain is up and good. And the lead now up to 14. Boy, I guess they're going to keep trying to put the pedal to the metal here. They're going to try an onside kick. And they've got it. They recovered it. They hang on now, though. There's a penalty flag down. Yeah, you got to wait until that ball goes 10 yards. They did not. They hit it before, and that draws the flag every time. And there's no doubt in my mind that converting an onside kick 
has never been tougher in the NFL with the new rules. So trying to get it to 10 yards, timing up perfectly, that's tough enough to begin with. But when you go ahead and grab it before it goes, you got no shot then. And this winds up a pickup of two, maybe two and a half to about the 39. The Saints going to call the first of their timeouts as they stop it with 11 seconds remaining in this first half. Play fake. Here's Dalton. That was going to let it go deep right sideline. And that's going to be too high. Out of bounds and incomplete. He did a good job keeping his focus downfield as he rolled out of the pocket, trying to fit a pass in. But that defender nearby made sure that one didn't result in a first down. And unless this is a quick incompletion, this is likely the last play here of this first half. The final act of the first half, Dalton. He's going to have his running back. It's complete. He's going to go out of bounds, but he takes this one down just shy of the 20. First half in the books. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. Welcome back. Halftime over. We are ready for quarter number three. Alongside Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon. And no return on this one as the fair catch is signaled for and taken. The Saints offense on the field ready to get their drive started. And right out of the gate they face what you think could be a pretty important drive. I would say so. You know, they're down two scores. That's not the end of the world. It wasn't the strongest of first halves, but for them to start calling back, They've got to start putting a little pressure on that defense, start cutting into this deficit. You can't have three and outs and expect to get that done. Boy, a lot of moving parts on this play, but what a nice design to leak the running back out to the left and send him down the field. And a good job spotting him and hitting him for a big play. On first and 10, here's Nancy Dalton. Alvin Kamara reeling it in on back-to-back -back plays. Touchdown, New Orleans! Alvin Kamara, 53 yards. And the Saints are back within a score. What's good on the extra point? And they're within seven now at 28-21. After the touchdown, Lutz to kick it off. Powell now to take it out of the end zone. And they'll get him down right around the 25, actually the 26 officially, so a net gain of one there. Set to begin their next drive, the Rams offense at the line. Play action, Stafford sliding out of the pocket, and that is incomplete. Took a shot there on first down, but he couldn't reel it in. So now second and 10 after the incompletion on first down. They'll go with Akers here up the middle. And forget about finding a lane. He barely had time to look up before he was planted in the backfield. It's a loss of four. Now third down. Going to need a crafty play call here. 14 yards is what they need to try to convert this thing. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. Oh, a hit. He lost the football. Stafford puts it on the ground. And this is picked up by the Saints. And they've got it very deep in enemy territory. It's inside the five at the three-yard line, first and goal. Kamara fighting, but he won't get too far. Maybe a yard, that's all, down to the two. It's a gain of a yard, and it'll set up second and goal. Again, Kamara trying to find a lane, but he finds nothing but defenders. Stop for no gain at the two-yard line. He got maybe a half yard at most, but officially they'll be left with a third and two. Now they'd really like to make the short field pay off. We'll see if they can, but this is third and goal. They'll try to run it in. It's Kamara, and I don't think Kamara got there. Looks like they stopped him short. That'll make it fourth down after a loss of one. Dalton now to pass. That is caught by Alave. Touchdown, New Orleans. A great effort there. 
Two catches, two touchdowns here so far. And the Saints' decision to go for it pays off with six points. Lutz with the extra point, and we are all tied at 28. So right back to square one, tied at 28 as he kicks it away. Powell now to take it out of the end zone. And he'll be stopped right around where he would have been had he gone down to a knee, maybe a yard shy of there at the 24. Set to begin their next drive, the Rams offense at the line. We got a brand new ball game all even after that last touchdown, so every drive now becoming a loop. Oh, a hit. He lost the football. Stafford puts it on the ground. Second time in this game, Charles, the ball has squirted out from his hands. Luckily, his teammate was there to pounce on it. You're right. Got the lucky bounce, able to retain possession. You know, we often talk about the combine and why do we measure quarterbacks' hands? Is that really a big deal? It's for situations like this. Do you have the hands big enough and strong enough to hold on to the football while being jostled? And it's incomplete. Took a shot, couldn't connect. And this drive is almost over before it began thanks to a great defensive effort. Sack on first down, followed by an incompletion. One more good rep, and they get off the field. Third and long, it's Stafford. And he overshot him there. It's out of bounds, incomplete. Finally, a good play there defensively on the deep ball. The secondary has had its struggles this entire game. Offensively, they've had their way with them. Here's Riley Dixon now. As the drive goes backwards, so he's on to punt it away. Taken in at the 22. That's going to go in the books as a 55-yard punt. Well done. And the Saints will take over with a first down and 10. The Saints offense on the field, ready to get their drive started. The offense coming back out here. Plenty of energy, ready to roll, looking to just add to what they have been doing after scoring a touchdown, Charles, their last time out. And that's a great feeling to have on the sideline, partner, knowing you just won the battle against the opposing defense. And since they came off the field, I'll guarantee you all they want to do is get back out there because they know they have the upper hand on that defense right now. That good for 21 yards on the catch and run. Well, they certainly spread the ball around so far, but they're definitely getting everyone involved now when you're throwing it to the fullback. Just shows how versatile this offense is and how everyone is a threat. Now Dalton with a first and 10. Pass the 20. Touchdown, New Orleans. Juwan Johnson, 48 yards. And the Saints have scored again in this third quarter, this time to move out in front. Lutz good on the extra point, and they will take a seven-point lead. Following the main field goal, Lutz to kick it away. Powell now to take it out of the end zone. And ultimately cannot get this out to the 25-yard line as he's dropped at the 23. Set to begin their next drive, the Rams offense at the line. They had that lead that is now gone. It is completely gone. Yeah, how does that affect the psyche? Or am I reading into that too much? They should be okay still? No, you're not reading into it too much at all. You've got to wonder what the psyche is of a team because once you build up a lead and things are rolling pretty well, you don't expect it to change. And for it to change this dramatically, and now they're the team doing the chasing, yeah, you want to check out where they are mentally and whether or not they have it in them to come back. We'll soon find out. Yeah, they're on their heels a bit right now. So they'll get a little extra time to come up with his third down play as we played three quarters. We'll return with more after this. This is the NFL, and it's on EA Sports. He rifles one that's intercepted. Picked off by Marshawn Lattimore. And the Saints are going to take possession of the football. Boy, what a turnaround. They exited the lockers with a nice lead, and now all of this. What's happened? So when you start to write your novel, you'll start out with, it was a tale of two halves, won't you? Well, hey, but I'm a bad writer. <laughs> I don't know exactly what happened, because sometimes teams can go in with a lead and get too comfortable, too relaxed, and a couple things go wrong, and it's hard to get back that good feeling. 
As soon as I saw him break contain and get outside, my first thought and my eyes gravitated downfield because nowadays, most of these quarterbacks, when they do that, they want the big play downfield. They don't want to throw it short. In this case, he took the shot. It fell incomplete. Well, they approached this drive with a lot of confidence after the last one ended up as a touchdown. But incompletions on their first two throws has them huddling up and trying to figure out a big play here on third down to get their momentum going again. Flushed out right. And that went a little too high as it's knocked away and incomplete. Nice call by the defense there on third down. Just flood the field with extra defensive backs in their dime package. Nowhere to go with the football. Forces the incompletion. And that's off the right upright. Thought it might sneak in, but it did not. It's no good. Set to begin their next drive, the Rams offense at the line. And still just down one score. We'll see how big of a role that missed field goal plays because it, of course, on Stafford for the third time is intercepted. Picked off by Paulson Adebo. And the Saints are going to take over here at their own 22-yard line. Well, that one was in the air for an agonizingly long time. Uh, just begging to be picked off, wasn't it? It's one thing if you're throwing a ball like that, trying to throw someone open or lead them into an area. But that ball needed to be thrown with a lot more conviction. As a result, it's an easy interception. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. And now the Rams are going to halt things as they want a timeout. It's just their first. They'll be down to two remaining as we step aside here in the fourth quarter. Dalton sets up play action. And this will be incomplete. Physical play on the football there, and it's second down. Well, they certainly did a nice job improvising there, extending the play, hoping someone would come open downfield, but they never did. <laughs> Trying to run down some clock with Kamara. And that one goes for about six as he's taken down just shy of the 45. All right, that's a decent game there, but it hasn't been his best game overall. So I wonder what the mindset is of his team. Do they want him to handle the football and try and close this game out? Or are they going to make an alternative plan and maybe go in a different direction? Uh, I think they need him, and this is his time to shine. Dalton up, play action. Flush to his right. Looking long for Thomas. And look at this. They get the turnover they needed. It's intercepted. And the Rams are right back in this football game. Yes, folks, that is his third interception. And I'm going to use one of the most overused phrases in football. He's a ball hawking safety. I love the way that you called for the shot there. That's perfect, though, because there is something to that. Being a safety often allows you freedom to roam around a defense, maybe not a specific assignment. Today, his assignment, find the football. And he's done so quite well. On first down, Stafford here. And this one hauled in, and again, it's Robinson. And they're going to get this to about the 44-yard line. The drive continues as they search for a tying touchdown. Here's first and 10. To throw is Stafford. And that's intercepted yet again, and that could be the backbreaker. Marcus May with a pick. And the Saints are going to take possession of the football. So it's Saints football as we get you reset. They've got a first and 10 as they look to try and finish this one off. Not running. Dalton wants to throw. It's incomplete. Took a shot, couldn't connect. Fair to say the secondary play, whichever side you're on, hasn't really been a glowing exhibition so far, but a nice job there to prevent a long completion. I agree with you, but at some point, someone had to make a play and try and stop this exhibition of almost speed racing that we've been watching, huh? Yeah, it has been quarterback and receiver dominated. Being chased out left. This ball tipped, and it's going to be incomplete. 
fortunate maybe to get that back. It's third down. Well, so far on this drive, they've done some good work. They force incompletions on first and second down, bring up third and ten. That brings up the big question. Do they bring pressure or do they play coverage on this down? Dance into his left. Looking left side, that's caught by Landry. And he's going to get this to the 31, but that is still well short of what he needed. Now the Rams will signal for a timeout their second as they'll head to the sideline and talk over what to do next. They'll try on fourth. Here's Dalton. Got an open man. It's Alave. And he gets it all the way down inside the 10 and mark him at the 5. It's first and goal and a late touchdown at this stage. Could officially salt this one away. Try to pound it in, Kamara. And he's across for the touchdown. And in the final minute, that should change. 